It always feels good to pet a dog or scratch a cat's back, but not all animals are meant to be nice. Even if they look cute and cuddly, it's best to avoid some animals. The sea is a very vast and uncertain terrain. We haven't explored all sea animals. We might think we know about a certain animal, but it can be a different type that can be deadly to humans. In this countdown, we'll show you some real-life clips of why these animals are dangerous for every topic. Here are 10 animals that make swimming extremely dangerous. Keep watching till the end and you'll know when waters are safe or not. Number 10. Big Ol' Sharks Sharks are terrifying creatures, but there is a higher chance you die electrocuted by the toaster than eaten by a shark. Researcher states that around 4 people a year die as a result of a shark attack. The good news is, is that sharks don't eat naturally humans. However, they might bite the surfboard or the surfer because they resemble the prey. So in the case with our surfer in this video, as he was ready to take on that wave, he felt a movement around his leg. Lucky for him, it was a competition and there were people readily waiting to rescue him. It is such a surreal moment, all he could do was scream and wait. I would never want to be in his shoes. Imagine the feeling at that moment when the shark almost bit him. Number 9. Let me slurp. Lampreys are found at the river bottom in the sand. When born, they wait seven years to come out. They have a circular mouth full of teeth, around 11 to 12 creepy layers to be exact. They even have two teeth under the tongue to get a good grip for blood suction. They draw blood from anything they can find, but mostly feed on fish. They resemble an eel, but their blood sucking power is not seen among other fishes. Their average kill number is 40 fish per year. When bitten by a lamprey, they can make a round circular mark on your hand. Many fish are found with such bites. As you can see in the clip, a lamprey attaches to the man's arm and won't let go. As soon as they detect blood near them, a commotion strikes and they're ready to look for a warm body full of blood. Next time you see an eel-like creature, don't stand there staring at it. Just run! What is your least favorite animal creature? Write your answer in the comment section. Number 8. Venomous Jellyfish Box jellyfish can be dangerous to humans. Their venom can easily kill us. I'm guessing the old peeing on a jellyfish sting trick won't help. A full-grown box jellyfish can kill up to 50 people with one sting. Scientists have been working on creating an antidote for these venomous creatures. One person who got stung by the jellyfish thought he was bitten by a shark. That's how hurtful the stings are. To explain how they attack, we will see their sting under a microscope. As you can see, the jellyfish is inserting each one of their tentacles inside and releasing the venom. They even seem to grow when they sting. Number 7. You can't see me. Stingrays are related to sharks. That being said, your dislike about stingrays should start to rise now. As we all are familiar with the famous crocodile hunter Steve Irwin, we know that he died due to a stingray attack. Stingrays are loners and only migrate for breeding. They use their tails to attack which possesses lethal venom or very sharp stings. However, these fishes are a sight to look at with their flamboyant colors and flat boneless bodies. What makes them dangerous for swimmers is that they actually stay on the seabed sand and stay near the shallow waters to prey on little fishes. This is what happened to this gentleman who didn't realize he stepped on the stingray while chasing another fish. If you didn't notice the strike, let's slow down the video and look at the right side. You can see a stingray flee up from the sand. The damage has already been done and the man doesn't realize this until it's too late. Now he's bleeding and needs help. Number 6. Stonefish Spines Now the tricky bit with these fish is that they look just like stone. You could be unlucky enough to walk about the shallows and step on it thinking it was just a rock. You will find yourself in immense pain as stonefish have 13 spines lining their back. The more pressure you apply, the more venom will be injected and the more painful it will be. After being stung by the stonefish, a human body can feel nausea, low blood pressure, slow heart rate, and swelling. As you can see, when the man presses an object against the spine, the venom shoots at such speeds and lengths. You might not be interested in penning the stonefish in the first place, but accidents can happen and this one might be your last. So if you ever find yourself tempted to touch a unique looking stone, think twice because it might be the venomous stonefish. Number 5. Sea Snake Attack These sea snakes are a delight for the eye. 
Their beautiful colors are just exquisite. But like many snakes, their venom is poisonous for humans. These snakes are so poisonous that only three drops of venom can kill eight people. A water snake becomes more dangerous as not only can it crawl on the ground, it can swim up too. If you're thinking that you don't swim down deep enough, you should be worried, because they can float on the surface too. That's actually how they breathe. As we can see here, the video is made from the point of view of the scuba diver. The snake is going around and suddenly decides to travel upwards towards the camera. We see a thud here because the scuba diver has been bit by the snake and he just collapsed. This is amazing footage that leaves us curious as to what happened to the person filming. Keep watching this video and maybe we'll cover the whole story soon. Number 4. Tiny Deadly Sting These are cute little octopus that I just want to keep as a pet. But hold on, there is a lot more to their cuteness. Despite their small size, they can cause some serious damage to humans. They can kill up to 26 humans in one go. They don't release inky fluid like other octopuses. Their sting contains a toxin that causes paralysis in humans. Their venom is held in the saliva glands. When they bite, they release the venom. They aren't aggressive, but if you disturb them or pick them up, they will bite you. As this brave fellow tries to bring the baby octopus back to the water, he doesn't even spare him and takes a bite. Number 3. Come Here A study says that all octopuses are venomous. They can grow as big as 600 pounds and 30 feet in length. They have eight limbs and two hearts. Not only can they swim in water, but also walk on land. If an octopus is following you and you think running in a room is your safest bet, well, you're wrong because they can open doors and jars using their two limbs. I'm just joking, but these creatures are dangerous and no doubt have been portrayed as monsters in many movies. Here is a clip of a man trying to film underwater and the octopus is not happy about it. You can witness how the octopus has wrapped himself around the diver and his equipment. Even after a good struggle, the octopus does not let go and hangs on to the camera. Maybe the octopus has filmmaking skills and wants to do a movie himself. Everyone should get a chance, don't you think? My pick for today is a classic, but still very dangerous. That being... Number 2. Hungry Piranha well, to put it in a very blunt manner, these piranhas are very aggressive towards humans. Just look at that fish. It straight off looks so demonic. They can smell a drop of blood in around 200 liters of water. If you ever get hurt while swimming, get out. They might be coming to catch you. They usually bite on toes and feet and can only bite once. These are wild creatures. As you can see in the clip, they are given a fish to feed on. In less than 30 seconds, the fish has been boned to its spine and is floating on the water. These are tiny creatures with really big appetites. We have seen piranhas as pets to people who are evil, and now it totally makes sense. An evil pet for an evil person. Number 1. Swimming Taser Electric eels are commonly found in South America. They can generate up to 600 volts to stun their prey. Yes, you got that. They use electric current. If you have the slightest idea of how it feels to be electrocuted, you can imagine that being in the water and attacked by an electric eel is not a fun combination. Getting attacked by an electric eel won't kill you, but it can incapacitate you which can cause you to drown. In the clip, you can see the man bounces back and falls onto the floor. This was a very small eel. If it was a full-size one, the man would have fallen unconsciously onto the ground. Thank you for watching. Click here to watch another video and make sure you subscribe to be part of the Taft fam.